Welcome back. This is Curtis with Sky Realty. Today I'm going to give you a quick demonstration on what Gravitars are and how to set one up. Gravitars, when, usually when you go to a blog, if you ever read a blog and you'll see in the comments some people might have a random image and some people may have a photo such as this lady in this one here. Well, these photos aren't actually hosted on this website. They're, they set up their Gravatar that follows a specific email. This um, Gravatar here just is generated by the website because they didn't have one set up. So what I'm going to show you is how to set this up so that when you post a comment and you use a specific email address, that image will show up. Simply go to en.gravatar.com. Once you're there, you can set up an account. It's free. Uh, to add an email address, now you can add, I don't know of a limit, I have an account where I have five different email addresses set up with Gravatars. Now this is not a re real email address, so do not email me at this address, you won't hear from me. Um, so to set up an email, first you hit add new email. Type in the email address here, hit add, and it'll send you a confirmation email. Once you um, select that confirmation email, it'll put your email here. Once your email is set up in their account, you'll have a big G next to it that says Gravatar. Now what you need to do is add an image. So I'm going to go here, I'm going to click here and add an image. I'm now going to go to my computer's hard drive. I'm going to browse for an image. I'm going to choose a rectangle image just to help you understand what um, how to crop the image. So this has a very simple image crop on it. So you can take an image if you uh, have a photo from a party or a get together or something where there's other people and you want to select just part of that image, this will allow you to do so. So then I come over here and I can preview my image. I'm simply going to hit crop and finish. I'm now going to choose the rating for this image, which is G-rated, obviously. And if you only have one email and one image, it assigns that image to that email automatically, and my Gravatar is now set up. It's that easy. Thanks, and have a great day.